It's your boy Link L number one two one five here with another battle review. UW Battle League. We got O Red versus T Rex. Before I jump into this review, slash rank. Um, people say I've been too nice to the people I say lost the battle. So I guess I'm gonna break it down a little more simpler. One through four, that's all chokes. How bad did you choke? Five is average. Six is above average. Seven is, is sick. Nice. Eight is hot. Nine is legendary. And ten is goat. So let's get into it. Round one. T Rex. Um, he does what we normally do. He's not really. I ain't gonna say scheme. He more of a sequence rapper. Like it's, it's a lot of bar sequence to one bar at the end that might not even be a punchline. It's just a cadence. Of how he said it that make it sound better than what it is they make it sound better than what it is um his first round it, it was solid to me um he had some bars i mean the one bar that stuck out to me um bars i thought was that stuck out he said um you think it's a joke then you can see that shit happened to mook was cool but try it with me i have you like cornbread you be down in the street something like that that was nice. I like the way he built that sequence. Then he went back into the corn bread. You was you corn, you was bread to be all that stuff. It was a nice round for T Rex. I mean, I saw him do way better. So to me, he got a he got a six point five in this round. It was above average. It wasn't quite there to sick or nice, but it, it was it was good though. I did I did enjoy it. O Red going. Um, my opinion. O Red first round. The first half, to me, I didn't care for it. Like, he was just setting up everything. He had some punch lines that was a little light, but I understood his the way he was going. He was just basically breaking down how he was going to destroy him. And it got it picked up when he said, the, um, Mook said for 25K, he kill a nigga that's ill. And for 25K, I kill a nigga for real. For 5K, you... Right about sucking dick to ill for Diddy 10k you suck a dick for real. The rhyme, the rhymes in that round picked up. It was more bar after bar after that, and I thought that round was actually better than T Rex. So I gave O Red a seven for that round. That's exactly why I gave him. Now round two, we got T Rex going back in. The beginning of T Rex round, he addressed it. Well, not really addressed. He talked about. Surf and how their loyalty in Jersey is not the same as loyalty in um Dot Mob. It, it was clever. I did like it. It was one of the best things in the battle. It just wasn't really about old red that much, so it, it was cool. But I did like it. Then after that, he started a, a little mini basketball sequence. I thought was actually good. Oh, uh, I think he said um, don't try me, nigga. I'm Kobe, nigga. I won't stop to shoot thirty, nigga. I'm Magic, not even worthy, nigga. I Euro stepped and shoot. I'm Ginobili, nigga. He said, um, I'm Rex to the same nigga. I'm literally retiring. I'm hanging up a jersey, nigga. Nice. I did enjoy that. I did enjoy that. Um, after that, he started spitting some bars. Some bars caught me. Some bars wasn't. It sounded like it was just more, just, I don't want to say filler, but that's what I'm going to say. It sounded like filler bars. These bars he just put together. For any any reason, it could have been on a song, it could have been on a freestyle he was going to do, then his battle came up. I don't know. But I feel it was better than the first round, so I did give it a 6.5. 6.5. Now, O-Red goes in. O-Red um, picks it right up in the second round um, where he left off in the first round. It's just hard to bar. He's setting them up. Some was lighter than I think he thought it would be. Um, some hit harder. Than I thought the crowd thought it was. I'm trying to think of a actual quote of that round. Uh, I believe we said the reason you're gonna see a region a stretch marks is the same reason the Jets lost. It's Rex fault. That was hot. That was hot. I mean, I I can't lie. Like it was hot. It was hot. I thought the way he ended his second round was clever too. When he said, "Even if you was the Ball headed Puerto Rican NYB flunky. It's no way can, there's no way that you can see O Red T easy. Get it? There's no way can you see O Red T 
easy. Wow. Wow. Um, round three, um, the, the final round, the round that is more deceiving to people. When you get to a round three in a battle, you actually can make people believe the other rounds was trash or even better than what they was. So, it's time for um, T-Rex to do what he do. T-Rex came in. His spaghetti, I liked, I liked, I liked a lot. It, but it was coming, um, it was a Bill Collector disc for the first couple bars. And it was hot, but he's not better on Bill. So, I, I can't quite give him credit as I want to for that. But it was clever. I did like how he put that sequence together. And I, I don't believe he said, um, I get your whole family, Merc. You're going to have to rock a Brady Bunch Rest in Peace t-shirt. That was crazy. That was that was crazy. That was a hot-ass line, actually. Then, um, again, after that, it seemed like it was some bars. The way the way his flow is, the, the way how T-Rex rap. He's really, he know how to project words. He know how to put stuff together. He know how to swag it out. So I wasn't bored watching this third round at all. But the things he was saying, again, wasn't really catered to the actual battle. I, I mean, that he was facing. It was just lines he could have rapped with anybody or even rapped on the beat, on the DVD freestyle, on the radio. So I thought it was good. And I do, I'm guessing me being biased, I gave it a 7. I gave it a seven. Now O'Rea goes in, and he says some some vicious bars in, in the third round. And um, I, I try to think of one quote where he said, "A, a nigga decked you off camera. Why didn't you murder Duke or let the burners shoot? Ice ordered that work for you. That finger roll was from Ice Man. He jerks Gervin you. <laughs> that was crazy, like." That was crazy. I don't even. It was nice, man. That was just nice. Kudos. I felt over it. Won this round as well. Uh, I gave him an eight. It was very hot. Lava. You know what I mean? Um, This battle. It could have been closer. But, I mean, it wasn't bad. The only thing I didn't like about the battle. I don't know what it is about the UW crowd. I don't know if it's just a bunch of rappers there. These dudes don't like the chair. They don't like the chair. At all. So, a line got to be ridiculously good for them to, like, give a praise. I do like that to a certain extent, but sometimes the battle seemed dull when there's no crowd reaction. Or you hear the crowd talking. But people was paying attention to the bars in this battle. So, it was a good battle. I do think Old Red won basically all three rounds. I don't just think it was a the, body. Um, the best round of this battle, I give to Old Red second round. The best bar of the battle is, is actually Old Red in the second round. I believe he said, um, I, I'm gonna, I probably won't butcher this bar. I do apologize if I do. Um, something cockiness, something cockiness, talking fly, I don't even talk, I let my machine talk for me, Johnny Five, if you try to Olay, I get your body wise, with that Tommy gun bang in the streets like Rocky Five, that was crazy, um, but on, unfortunately the worst bar of the battle goes right after that, cause he said I let the Tommy gun bang in the Streets like Rocky Five and like Rocky Five, you know, it was a uh, Apollo versus Drago, something like. Stop. That was Rocky Four. 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 So it's a little simple mistake. I had to figure out what was really a corny bar. There really, was no corny bars in this battle, so I just picked out the ones that actually was a mistake. Um, that was my mind frame. I want y'all to join. Please join the battle community. Join the channel. Join the channel. More videos coming to you soon. And I will drop my top 10 female better rappers of the world. I guess I should drop my top 10 male better rappers of the world. But that list is so much more difficult. So I guess so. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.